In mid-March 2021, we brought together 45 rangatahi from across our region for Hawke's Bay's first Youth Climate Action Camp. We had been thinking about this since the strike for climate two years ago. It was led by Hawke's Bay Regional Council with the support of many of our partners. Over the two and a half days, they got to hear from inspirational and educational speakers, went on field trips and solved problems collaboratively. It gave us a chance to build knowledge, friendships and skills with the ultimate outcome to empower them to make changes for our future by tackling the climate crisis. This camp was a great example of how organisations, councils and leaders can come together to support the next generation. They all left with some goals for the future for their own schools in Farnow. Kia ora, my name is Tom. I'm a Year 11 high school student at Taradale. I've really enjoyed the Youth Climate Action Camp and I've taken away a lot of this and the other students at Taradao will be able to take all the information we have learnt from our keynote speakers and take that back to our school and make positive change. Hi there, my name's Ashmeen Jolliffe and I'm from Hastings Girls High School. Here at the Hawke's Bay Youth Climate Action Camp, we've had a crew of nine girls from Hastings Girls. Um, we've really benefited from this camp um, with the amazing speakers and group activities that we've done. We've learnt heaps to take back to school and we'd just like to give a massive thank you to the Hawke's Bay Regional Council for providing us with this opportunity. Talo Falaba. I am Elijah McGillivray here with a couple of my friends from Winnie Kaliza College. Here at camp we learn about the pros and cons of environmental change and why climate change is bad. I'm happy to take this information back to school and spread it around the community. Thanks HVRC for organising this event. We have a huge opportunity for our community to create innovative solutions to climate action and build an environment future generations can be proud of. While the Regional Council is a leader for climate action in Hawke's Bay, we can't do it alone. We can't wait to see what develops and how they will use their new knowledge. We plan to continue working with this keen and energetic group of rangatahi and maybe have another camp in two years' time.